Good evening, my dear students. How are you? We're fine, teacher. Excellent. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Happy? What do you have for breakfast today? What do you have for breakfast today? Uh, tacos, tacos, tacos in breakfast. Wow, good. Sí, son unas tortillas de harina y llevan, llevan un huevo, un huevo ah. y, y breakfast. Breakfast tacos. Okay. Tacos de huevo. Eggs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eggs. Breakfast tacos. Eggs. Breakfast, uh -huh. eggs. Uh -huh. And coffee. And coffee. Do you like a small or big breakfast? Or, or breakfast. A big breakfast. A small breakfast. Oh, I love big breakfast. I love, I, I like uh, fried beans, egg, scrambled eggs, cheese, cream, avocado, three tortillas, coffee. So I'm happy. Teacher, okay. excuse me, uh, I am working. Okay, Fernando. Yes. Okay, okay. Don't worry, Fernando. I, I will only listen. Listen, okay, you're gonna be a listener, all right? Good. Okay, let's start the class, my friends. I'm going to share my screen. Here we are. Let me see. Oh, yes. I know what it is. Yeah. Uh, okay, my friend, today we're going to start uh, writing an email describing people. Remember, we yesterday we were talking about how to describe people's appearance. Uh, we describe hair, uh, look, uh, what else? ¿Qué más describimos? Appearance. Tall teacher. Ah, height, height and, and high and weight. Correct. Weight correct. and height. Weight and height. Good. Ahora, you imagine this. Mire, take a look. Imagine your EPL is coming to visit you for the first time. You and a classmate are meeting him or her at the airport. Write an email describing yourself and your classmate. Okay. But don't describe your, your classmate. Just describe yourself. Describase usted, por favor. Okay. And send that email to the chat. Okay. O sea que el chat es nuestro email, ¿ok? Ahí lo va a meter, ahí lo va a mandar. Ok. Mire cómo comienza. Take a look. Say, Dear Ahmed, I'm meeting you at the airport at noon on Sunday. My friend is coming with me. Attach, attach is a photo of both of us. And you can see we're both in our like, late teens. My friend is fairly tall and very pretty. She has. Entonces aquí lo que va a hacer ustedes, um, I'm meeting you at the airport at noon. Puede ser lo mismo, ¿verdad? I am, I send you a photo. I am, ¿qué? I am black hair, brown eyes, uh, thin, etc. Ahí usted se describe, ¿ok? 
Let's do that, please. Let's start describing yourself and send it to the chat. Comencemos. Understand the activity? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay, let's do it. Thank you. El sensei que le dice me hizo una oferta muy generosa y me enorgullece decir que Topanga Karate está ahora bajo una nueva dirección. Estamos encantados de ser parte de la familia Kona. Gracias, sensei Rosetta. Se preguntará qué significa esto para el... Close your mics, please. Ahí escucho una película. Thank you. Como que es para niños esa película. Let's do it. Okay, Rebecca. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, vamos a parar un poco la, um, la actividad. Tenemos a alguien de inglés corporativo que nos va a comunicar algo. Okay, so pay attention, please. Mayra, te dejo aquí a los chicos. Ok, teacher, muchísimas gracias. Buenas Bien. noches, estimados estudiantes. El motivo eh, por el cual yo estoy aquí en este momento es para hacerles un atento recordatorio a los siguientes puntos. Número uno, que ustedes deben de enviar lo que sería el comprobante de manual, por favor, si es posible el día de mañana, en el transcurso de la semana, para que puedan hacer válida su reinscripción. En referencia a su reinscripción, recordarles enviar el formulario para poder hacer eh, completa el, la gestión de la reinscripción. Y por favor, recordarlos las notas de plataforma. Les han estado enviando mensajito de recordatorio por medio del grupo de WhatsApp para que ustedes puedan enviar ahí lo que sería la documentación. Si no, en un dado caso, pues también pueden comunicarse con el gestor que les está dando seguimiento, ya sea Flor o Paola. Ustedes le envían la documentación para que ella les pueda apoyar. Así que, eh, bueno, recordándoles, comprobante de manual, documentos de reinscripción, formularios, y las notas de plataforma. No se les olviden, teacher, por favor, apóyenme con ellos en este eh, aspecto de hacerles un pequeño recordatorio por si acaso eh, se les olvida o si en un dado caso, pues uno de los participantes no está presente en este momento para que lo puedan hacer. Tienen esta semana, estimados. Mayra. Ok, muchas Mayra, gracias. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Hola, Mayra. buenas noches. Dígame, dígame. Buenas noches, perdóneme, antes de que se vaya a salir, fíjese de que tenemos problemas en la plataforma con el audio del de 4.8 y es, tenemos desde la semana pasada de estar en el chat recordándole, pero nadie nos, nos dice nada. Entonces, si ¿sí nos podría ayudar, por favor, porque creo que somos todos, no sé, los demás compañeros si ya pudieron escuchar el audio. No, yo ya terminé el, el módulo, eh, la, la, perdón, ¿verdad? Esta unidad y no llega ni al 80 sin ese audio. Oh. Y es el único que me hace falta. Y dice que no está disponible. Ajá, eh, no Perfecto. da como error. Me dijeron 4.8, Sí, 4.8. Perfecto. Yo mañana lo reporto y estaríamos eh, apoyándoles con la gestión. Muchísimas gracias. Con muchísimo gusto. Cualquier cosita, pues, eh, lo escriben al grupo. Si no, de igual manera, recuerden que cada uno de ustedes hizo la gestión con algún gestor diferente. Entonces, pueden también escribirles a ellos para que les puedan apoyar. ¿Ok? Perfecto. 
Muchísimas gracias, teacher, por el tiempo. Le dejo con su clase. Muchísimas gracias, okay, estimados estudiantes. Orden. Y aprovechen su tiempo. Adiós. A la orden, adiós. Ok, let's continue. Let's continue with your email. Finish. Send it, send it. Send it to the chat. Para Claudio María, para que sea un email, faltó redacción. Mire aquí, Dear Ahmed, entonces póngale aquí, querida María, Dear María, I'm meeting you at the airport. Esto es, lo, esto es co eh, copy and paste es prácticamente, ¿verdad? I'm meeting you at the airport at noon on Sunday. I am, y ahí va, ¿eh? I am short, tall, eh, ok, ahí va, okay. ok, hay que ponerle un, más carnita a ese, a ese, a ese correo. Ok, hay work class, sí, pero, para quién va dirigido, ok, my friend, okay. Uh, hi, dear friend, my name is Wendy, I am tall, I have curly short hair, uh, curly, Brown short hair. I have brown eyes. Uh, da, 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 da. It's okay. Poquito más. Ahora que vamos a ver qué más. Okay, excellent. Good. Ahí estamos. No more. Ah, oh, this is. 
says, Dear Peter, I'm meeting you in the mall. I am fairly tall and I have curly black hair and, and I'm a little shabby. I'm sorry to meet you. See you tomorrow. Good. Excellent. No more. Hurry up. Sir. Sure. Hello. Is a description of himself? Yeah, of yourself. Yeah. All right. Okay, don't even, don't worry. Just try to. Thank you, sir. Okay, don't worry. But you are, you're okay. You're happy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, excellent, excellent. Good to see you, Dorigo. Okay, two more minutes. Two more minutes, my friends. Heriberto says, let me see, Heriberto. Hi, dear Michelle, my name is Raul. I'm brown skin with a small eyes. I'm tall. One meter seventy. And now I really like sports. Okay, good. Let me see this. Dear Alan, how are you? I see that you have changed a lot. You are very tall. I am a little thin. And my hair is long, long. Ah, my hair is longer. Okay, so I am thinking of cutting it a bit and changing the look. I hope we will see each other soon. I love you very much. Okay, entonces este, este chico no era, no era desconocido. All right, let me see. Um, Leah, dear classmate, my name is Leah. I'm sure I have black long hair, brown eyes, I am friendly. It would be fantastic to meet you in person. Excellent. So, I'm meeting you at the airport at night on Monday. My brother is coming with me. You ask. <laughs> Me equivoqué y te llevé con G. Es package. Ah, este. packages. Yeah. Sí, pero uh -huh. después, about us. Uh, no. The, the spelling allí. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> Be careful with the, with the typing. You can see we're pretty tall. Okay. I'm going to the look. Okay, that's okay. But check the spelling. Después about us and then 
la otra palabrita esa. ¿De qué? Ok, we're finished. Let's continue. Thank you. The, the last one. Hello, friends. My name is Damaris. I'm slim. I'm tall. And I have long hair. I have dark brown eyes. And I'm very, I'm a very patient person. You should be a doctor. Okay, my friend. Next activity. Fashion. We're going to talk about fashion. Fashion, okay, in the public eye, that's the name of a, on an article. Okay. Fashion on the street. Let me see. Button down shirt. What does it mean? Button down shirt. You have an idea? Cuello bajo. No. Botón cuello bajo. Botón cuello bajo. No, oh, botón, camisa de botón. Es como camisa botonada. Belt. Cinturón. Ah, slacks. Ah, it's like cortes. A, it's, it's like a formal pants. No son los slacks. Formal, formal. formal pants. Okay. Sí, dress y pants, ya. Yeah. Dress shoes, mire, dress shoes. Zapatos oh. de beso. Ajá, excelente. Eso es, formales también, formales. Formal. So, describe your style, classic. Like a maitro, ¿ah? Like a señor. Now, this guy is young. He's a Young boy, it's a teenager. Jacket, sweater, cargo pants. You know what are the cargo pants? Pantalones con. Es como un pantalón con comando. Ajá, con bolsa, ¿verdad? Con bolsas por todos lados. Eh, loose pants, son flojos. Like wrappers. Los raperos pusieron de moda ese chuncho, ¿ok? De tennis shoes, ¿ok? Describe your style, cool and casual. Vamos a ver esta chica. Es a multicolor girl. She has a teacher, horse, play skirt. You know what is play? Falda corta. No. But play, we're talking about the pattern. Es el patrón de, de, la, de la tela. Es cuadriculada. 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 Corre, cuadriculada. Excelente. Yes. Es cuadriculado. Stripe tights. Medias rayadas. Medias rayadas. <laughs> Describe your style. Funky. Which clothes and items do you wear almost every day? Can you tell me? I, I wear uh, uh -huh. a sport teacher uh -huh. with a pair of pants, uh, tennis shoes. Yeah, that's okay. So, what, what do you think is your style? So, so, my style cool and casual, classy. Uh, thing is sport, but sport, I think. Sporty? Mm -hmm. ah, okay, all right. Someone else. Vamos, continue. What? My, my style. Uh -huh. mm, classic. Classic. What do you wear? Eh, eh, pero como digo, también, o sea, también este, eh, sport. Okay, you can say classic and sometimes 
four. Ah. Yeah, we both. But yeah, when you go to work, classic. And when you uh, get home, sport. Or on the weekends. Yeah, we wear shorts, sandals, tennis, t-shirts, caps. Teacher, I usually use uh, classic. Ah, for work. Classic. I, I... Yeah, yeah, formal, formal, uh, formal dressing. Yeah, I usually wear polo shirts, jeans, and casual shoes because of my job. It's, it's the uniform. Okay. Um, let's continue then. Someone else? Oh, alguien, alguien estaba ahí queriendo. Let me see. Ah, ya la vi. Ahí es tarde. ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué? No me quieren ver, va. Ah, ya la vi. Se esconde. ¿Por qué se esconde? ¿Quién dijo miedo? ¿Quién dijo miedo? Ok. Eh, let me see. Jacqueline, you, what, what do you wear? Or what clothing do you wear almost every day? I wear big, big t-shirt. Huh? And shirt. Shirts. And and flip flop. Flip flop. Okay, excellent. Thank you. So your style is, is relax. Yes. It's relax. <laughs> okay. Let's continue with another activity. We have a conversation here. Which one is she? Hi, Raul. Okay, let me, let me take a picture. Hi, Raul. Good to see you. Where's Maggie? Oh, she couldn't make it. She went to a concert with Alex. Oh, well, why don't you go and talk to Julia? She doesn't know anyone here. Julia. Which one is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? No. She is the tall one in jeans. She's standing near the window. Oh, I like to meet her. She's the tallest one. Okay, my friends, any question? Pronunciation? Hello? Are you okay? It's okay, teacher. Okay, let's go to the rooms and practice the conversation, please. Let me see. Do we break up rooms? And... Let's do it. You're going to have four minutes to practice. Hi. 
No. Se me descargó los audífonos, teacher. Ah. Y así casi no escucho, me voy a poner cerca el teléfono. Ok, ok. Hay que checar eso. Sí. Vale. ¿No tiene uno de emergencia? No, pero más o menos. Aquí tengo que oír cerca. Ok, ok. Vaya, que este, ¿qué compañero está para este, la traducción? ¿Compañeros? Ya entró, Doribel, porque aquí dice que no ha entrado. Sí, aquí estoy. Permítame. Sí. Dicho, yo no puedo, ahorita estoy trabajando. Ok, 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 Lorena, no te preocupes. Déjame ver. Vamos a enviar a Doribel a otro grupo. Ahorita le envío a Doribel. What are you? Hello. How was the practice? How was the conversation? Nice, me. Nice. Excellent. Who wants to practice right now with me? Me, teacher. Okay, let's do it. You are Liz. Okay. Hi, Raul. Good, good to see you. Where's Maggie? Oh, she couldn't make it. She went to a concert with Alex. Oh, well, why don't you go and talk to Julia? She doesn't know anyone here. Julia, which one is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? 
No, she's the tall one in jeans. She's standing near the window. Oh, I like to meet her. Excellent, Wendy. Good pronunciation. Thank you, teacher. Excellent pronunciation. Pelea de ayudar mucho a sus compañeros. Okay, any other? Uh, do we have another participation? Yeah, me. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll start. I'll start, okay? All right. Hi, Raul. Good <clears throat> to see you. Where's Maggie? Oh, she couldn't make it. She went to a concert with Alex. Oh, well, why don't you go and talk to Julia? She doesn't know anyone here. Julia? Which one is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? No, she's the tall one in jeans. She's standing near the window. Oh, I like to meet her. Excellent. Excellent pronunciation. Okay, one more participation. Come on, don't be pena. You can make it. Who's, who's, Me, who's, teacher. Okay, let's do it. You are Liz. Okay. Hi, Raul. Good to see you. Where's Maggie? Oh, she couldn't make it. She went to a concert with Alex. Oh, well, why don't you go and talk to Julia? She doesn't know anyone here. Julia, which one is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? No, she's the tall one in jeans. She's standing near the window. Oh, I'd like to meet her. Excellent. Good. Let's continue. Next activity, my friends. Okay, let's take a look at this. Okay, this is, a, uh, this is about grammar. So, we're going to see modifiers with particle, part, participles, and preposition. Okay, take a look. It says, who's Raul? He is the man. He is the man, yeah? Which one is Raul? He is the one. Okay, come on back. He is the man wearing a green shirt. Which one is Raul? He is the one talking to, to Liz. Okay, in this case, we are using the participles, okay? Wearing and talking, okay? Like the present participle. Present participle is the same present continuous, okay? Por aquello de las dudas. Pues que es participles. Es el ando endo, okay? Like, yo pregunto, who's Raul? Or who's Michael? Who's John? He is the because, man. Hello. And these are the participles. Is always we using the ing. Or... Ing. Yes. Yeah. That's a, yeah. That's a, that's yeah. That's the that's true. the that's the question. I mean, that's the point. That's the point. Take a look. He is the man wearing. Uh, here he is the one talking. Yeah. In the case of the de la conversación. Let's go back to the conversation. ¿Cómo se refieren a, a la chica? Dice Is the woman wearing glasses? Wearing. Mire. Abajo corrigen. No. She's the tall one in jeans. She's standing. Mire. Got it? So the same here. Ok, y si la persona estuviera sentada, is the man sitting. Got, got the idea? My dear students, got the idea? Got the point? Yes or no? 
Okay. If I ask uh, where is Tori Bell? Ah, is, is the girl y ella está viendo TV. ¿Cómo diríamos? Is the is watching, watching TV. TV. Pero primero va a esto de aquí, ve. She is the woman watching, watching TV. TV. Miren, okay. Ya, ya, ok, eso ya me deja tranquilo a mí, ok. I'm satisfied that you understand. All right, excellent. Ahora, let's take a look and let's see uh, the prepositions. ¿Cómo, cómo Because this is like a description. Yeah? This is like a description. When you're talking about someone, y le dice, ah, es el fulano tal y tal, haciendo esto, o oh, está vistiendo esto. We're doing that, ¿ok? Vamos a ver aquí. Dice, who's Liz? She is the woman with short black hair. Another example. Which one is Julia? She is the tall one in jeans. Who are the Smith? There are the people next to the window. Which one are the Smith? They're the ones on the coach. Okay, pero teacher, aquí dice preposition, yes. And what are the prepositions here? With, in, next to, and on. All right? This is like to, to emphasize or to address to the people, to point at the people and where are, where are they, okay? Understand? Yes, teacher. Okay, yeah. okay. Now, you're going to rewrite these statements using modifier with part participles or preposition either way, okay? So, Clark is the tall guy. He's wearing a bottom-down shirt and cargo pants, okay? Y luego quedó así, mira. Clark is the tall guy wearing a bottom down shirt and cargo pants. Yeah, we made a. We made a. a, a from two sentences, we made one. ¿Qué hicimos aquí? Let, let's check. Clark is the tall guy. Okay, aquí lo tengo. Clark is the tall guy. Okay, yeah. I omit his. Mire, esto, this disappears. And then I continue writing down all the things here, okay? So, Clark is the tall guy wearing, lo voy de una vez aquí, okay? So, his is drop out, okay? Continue with number two, three, four, and five. And then we check. Let's do it. Do it on your... Okay, Dorivel. I know you have problems. Write it on your notebook, okay? Ahí sale más rapidito. Then I'm going to ask you.
Okay, who has number number two right now? Um, teacher could Adam be and Luis are the good looking couple talk, talking to them. Okay, thank you. Uh, yes, yes, uh, thank you. You can you can read it too. La, la compañera ahí, que no alcancé a ver quién era, pero el compañero lo, lo dijo bien. Yes, you did it well. Liz. Line is the young girl in a striped t-shirt and blue jeans. Ok, muy bien. Ok, so, ok, I'm going to read number two. Como dijo el compañero allá, yo no, I, I didn't catch the, the, his name. Adam and Louis are the good looking couple talking to Tom. Lynn is the young girl in a striped t-shirt and blue jeans, okay? This is a stripe, stripe, okay? Okay, who has number four? Jessica is the attractive woman sitting to the left of Antonio. Yes, excellent. Jessica is the attractive woman sitting to the left of Antonio. And number five. AJ is the serious look looking boy listening to his new salsa CD. Excellent. AJ is the serious looking boy listening to his new salsa CD. Perfect. Oh, aquí tenemos, eh? Jacqueline Rose, Aran and Luis are the good looking couple talking to. Very good, excellent. Lynn is the young girl in a striped feature and blue. And Jessica is the attractive woman sitting to the left of Antonio. And Jay is the serious looking boy listening to his new salsa CD. Perfect. Okay. Let me fix this. Okay, we have a reading here. It says, what hit of fashion do you know? Shown the article to find three fashions. Okay. Oh, no, sorry, a scan. <laughs> Shot. A scan the article to find three fashions, okay? Let's, I'm gonna read and then you're going to do the exercise, okay? Teenagers who listen to the same music often have a common look. One has style in music and fashion is hip hop. Simply put hip hop is a type of urban music with a heavy beat, typical includes baggy pants, sweatshirts, hiking boots, baseball caps, and usually worn backward 
backward jackets with sports logos and expensive athletic shoes. In the hip hop style, boys and girls often dress the same way. African American kids in Detroit and Chicago first made hip hop fashion trendy more than 20 years ago. They wore baggy, baggy street clothes to dance clubs. Then North America and European bands all began wearing this style. Thanks to the popularity of music videos and movies, hip hop soon became an international fashion sensation. Things around the world from Britain to South Africa to Japan now wear hip hop clothing. 17 year old Melanie Barrow of Manchester, England says, my pride and joy in life are my Levi's jeans. In the United States, teens spend a lot of money on hip hop fashion. David Bowen, 17 of Evanston, Illinois, has five pairs of hiking boots, each costing around 100 bucks. David says, they're popular because a lot of hip hop performance wear them. Okay, my friends. We read the, the article and find the, the three fashions shown. Let's find three fashions. So they say that there are three fashions here in the article. I don't know what they are. You have to look for them. Vamos, scanning. Urban. Okay, urban. Urban is one. International teacher. International. I don't know. You tell me. Que habla algo acerca de la ropa callejera urbana. No ok, sé. ok. Baggy Street Clothes. Baggy Street Clothes. Ok, tenemos dos. Tenemos Hip Hop. Hip Hop Fashion. En Baggy, Baggy Street Clothes. I think it's uh, Levi jeans in the United States. Device. No. Device jeans Device in the United jeans. States. Yeah, my pride and joy in life are my Levi's jeans. Okay, so we have urban, hip hop, style, baggy street, baggy street, baggy street clothes, yes.
Okay, we're gonna leave it like that and we're gonna take the attendance. Time passes so fast. Okay, uh, Anna Elizabeth. Present. Thank you. Heriberto. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Alberto. Present teacher. Thank you. Claudia Maria. Present teacher. Thank you. Christopher, Chris, Chris, no Chris, um, Damaris, tampoco. No da más. Me avisan si escriben al chat, por favor. Pero por, ahí están ambos. Los dos. Sí, ahí está Christopher y Damaris. No. Ahí está, mire, ahí escribió. Ahí escribieron. Ah, ok, gracias. Ok. Eli. Present. Thank you. Estuvo calladito el libro. Fernando. I'm here. Thank you. Jacqueline. Jacqueline Cermeño. Present. Oh, thank you. Okay. Jacqueline Guevara. Present teacher. Thank you. Casey. Present teacher. Thank you. Carla. Present teacher. Thank you. Leah. Teacher, sorry. Yes. Present teacher. Dice la compañerita Doribel que no tiene audio, pero que... Ah, ok. No, ya, está. ya, ok. Di, avísemele que ya está. Ok. Que sí se estuvo comunicando conmigo. Ok, thank you. Lorraine, por favor, avísame. Present teacher. Thank you. Luis Fernando, creo que pidió permiso. Sí, él pidió permiso. Re Rebeca. Aquí estoy. No, aquí estoy, aquí estoy. Ah, oh, sorry. Okay. Rebecca. Present teacher. Thank you. Marielos. Saúl. I will uh, present. Thank you. Wendy. Present teacher. Thank you. And we're done. Okay, my dear students. That's all for now. Take care of yourself. Good night. And see you tomorrow at nine. See you tomorrow, teacher. Thank you. Goodbye. Big breakfast for tomorrow. Big breakfast. Okay. Okay. Minimal 
four pupusas. <laughs> <laughs> and chocolate. Good night, teacher. Good night. I'm gonna wait for one more minute. Just in case. Bye -bye.